Hello and welcome, I'm Roy Lewis Photographer and today I'm going to be talking about Epson's brand new SCP900 printer. I'm no stranger to Epson having used the previous model for a number of years and I can safely say that this new model is a great improvement. For the past 15 years I've photographed many of the world's most recognised faces from Sir Patrick Stewart to Sir Ian McKellen, Dame Judi Dench and many others and for me to print your work is to really add value to your work. Printing my work is very important and Epson Sure Colour printers have always been a bastion for me of creating most superior quality prints. Now let's take a look at this amazing brand new printer from Epson. Epson has always been at the top of their game in producing superior vivid quality prints for my exhibitions. The printer boasts the brand new F10 print head and also contains 10 cartridges. The printer has been designed to produce truly outstanding print quality. The use of the Ultra Chrome Pro 10 ink and a newly developed F10 print head and black enhance overcoat technology help to provide increased black density. This translates to deeper blacks, less grain in your prints. Epson have also equipped the printer with an expanded blue gamut which allows more accuracy to reproduce the image on your screen. As a fine art portrait photographer, shadows, dark backdrops are very important to my work and seeing this new feature allowing deeper blacks, less grain is really, really important and you can just see that on the quality of the prints. Having used the previous model, the introduction of the LCD panel is a huge improvement. The LCD panel 4.3 inch is an optical touch panel. Selecting settings is simple. You can even see the print off as it prints. The screen can be customized to display the information that is relevant for you. Designed to print A2, I'm amazed by the compact size of this printer. It can easily fit on any desk in a small office or workspace. The design of this printer is pleasing to the eye. It's less bulky than its predecessor. It's been beautifully designed without compromising print quality, reliability or functionality. Just have a look at the quality. The blacks really stand out. Deep sharp vivid images and this is what I expect from a printer. As a fine art portrait photographer I'm truly impressed by this new model. Outstanding prints come as standard with this model. Making use of the 10 inks, the Ultra Chrome Pro, the latest printhead technology it really produces realistic colours, deeper blacks, high contrast, sharper details and smooth graduations. Both the front tray extends and the rear tray extends, enabling you to print up to A2 plus images. The Epson Pro 10 ink is designed to offer reliable and stunning results every time. And they're quick drying to help prevent smudging, which is really important in my work. Often you find when you print something on a basic printer, you get really horrible smudging. This ensures a clear, precise outcome. Combined with the Epson print heads, which eject droplets of ink via mechanical pressure rather than heat, so each drop of ink is more precise, you'll enjoy sharper, richer images and fast printing times. Some people prefer glossy papers. I don't. I prefer matte or cotton or textured papers. In using the printer for these examples, I use the Epson Fine Art Cotton Textured Bright Paper. As you can see, it gives a vivid, wonderful textured design. The quality in this is amazing. You can see here the benefit of the brand new 10 inks, the new print head and the black tones just really stand out. One of the brand new features of this printer is the ability to actually see the print as it prints off. There is a clear screen and an internal light that shows you the print as it prints. So this is really good, especially if you're printing something incorrectly, if you've made a mistake, then you can see exactly what's going on. And if you make that mistake, you can stop the print so you don't waste ink or paper. This is a really great feature that sometimes I make mistakes and this is something that is going to really help me in the future. 
Printing an A2 roughly takes around about five minutes. Uh, as you can see from the step change videos that we've produced, you can see the quick motion of the printing. This is not representing, you know, the, the time it takes to print. Of course, it's going to take a little bit longer. But these videos just quickly illustrate the quality of the printer, the action of the printer, how it's working. And uh, as you can see, the quality and the results are vivid. One of the things I've noticed is that the Wi-Fi feature has improved greatly from the previous model. The printer is printing a lot faster, it's receiving the data more quickly. One of the things I like to do is keep my printers mounted on a trolley. This enables me to move them around the studio space, enabling me to set up and print where needed when I'm doing a job, showing clients the pictures that I'm producing. So using that Wi-Fi feature is really, really important. And this new model produces faster connections to our Wi-Fi system. And that is one of the features that I love the most. If you're a fine art photographer, a photographer involved in landscapes, portraits, beautiful visual art, then I recommend the series of Epson Sure Color printers. If you want to bring out the quality of your work, if you want to add value to your work, then printing is essential and choosing the right printer is part of that. And for me, the Sure Color printers have always served me well.